For Boston College, the lefty, Lauren Daly, the junior, out of New York in the cage. An all-ACC second team starting every game this season for Boston College. In goal for James Madison, the redshirt freshman, Molly Doherty. Nine saves in the semifinal win over North Carolina. Improving to 13-0 as a starter this year. Overtime with the victory, but it is a challenge. It is a challenge, and each team has their own t different tweaks to the zone defense they'll play. Doherty so comes up with the first stop for James Madison. Big stop for Doherty right there. You have to adjust the way the teams are playing a zone, and right now, early on from JMU, they're playing having stacking players down low in the zone, so you just have to read. We heard in Acacia Walker's pregame speech talking about understanding what type of defense they're in. Weather today, the ball might be on the ground a bit more than usual. JMU dominated the ground ball battle on Friday, 15-4. to BC needs to, to improve upon that. BC set up for a free position shot. That one saved once again by Doherty, her second stop for the redshirt freshman. The JMU staff very unhappy, pointing to the instant replay here at the field. They thought that was a clean interception. Doherty yeah. once again with the save off the free position shot from Kara Urbank, the sophomore midi for Boston College. I agree, Hallie. I mean, just looking back at it, I don't think the foul was there. They did put number one to that last goal, the fourth goal that JMU scored. We're looking at the crease violation. And watch the feet and the line right there, the toe on the line, and then rounding around the crease. You are not able to step on the crease line at all. Your stick can follow through. Not able. That should be no goal. Katie Kerrigan with a great feet award on the run. Daly with an incredible stop for BC. And the offensive coordinator for this BC team is Kayla Trainer at Syracuse. She played against the zone defense every day in practice. She can certainly tell this offense a thing or two about breaking down a zone. Doherty the save. That might have been the biggest offseason acquisition in women's lacrosse <laughs> this year. Kayla Trainer coming in and making played the role Friday of Megan Whittle during the practice leading up to the semifinal against Maryland. Shot on the run by Warden. She's had opportunities and a battle to the end line. Closest to the ball before out of bounds, Skane's possession. It will stay with James Madison. Shot high off the stick of the sophomore, Maddie McDaniel. Guardian, that one falls into the crease, into the stick of Lauren Daly. At the break, BC told their players. McDaniel sends it. Goal line extended to Kerrigan, 19 and white. Marked by Carly Bell, the senior. Circles the crease going low, and Daly the save. That's a nice save for Daly right there. Good rocker step behind the cage. Excellent stop, just what BC needed. It's a great opportunity. Arsenal against Doherty and Cage. Junior trying to bounce, stays with BC. Second oh. chance in front, what a save by Doherty. Possession clock gets reset. Big stops for Doherty right now. It's a long offensive possession. That great dynasty for the Terps that have won 13 national championships. But losing in Friday's semifinal to Boston College, which is a rematch of last year's title game. Shot Daly with a stick from point blank range. Excellent stop by Daly and controlling that ball in her stick. Oftentimes you see goalies make an amazing save, but it pops out in front of the crease and becomes then a, a garbage goal inside. Great job corralling that and getting the clear out. Lauren Daly, who split time and goal with Zoe Ochoa last year, now with her fifth save in this national championship game. Great recovery defensively for James Madison. In front, set up. That one went off the post as Chandler nearly stuck in her third goal of the game. Off the restart. Kerrigan circles the cage, trying to set up the pass. Down to four. James Madison's got to get a shot off. Haven right into the stick of Daly. It's a big win for Boston College, letting that shot clock expire. It's Walker. Three-second violation. Called on Elizabeth Miller. 
or not on Elizabeth Miller, but it is on Elizabeth Miller, just rotating her back to where the foul occurred. So that violation is when a defender's in that eight meter area for more than three seconds without marking up with a player within a stick slang. James Madison Warden thought about passing. That bouncer could have nearly been the dagger for Boston College. As we're stressing, play discipline. Don't foul. Don't put this team on the line. Don't let them back in. Keep them out. Inside a Puzo shot on the run. Doherty there for her seventh save. None bigger than the one against the Tortoreton finalist. James Madison was known as the Cinderella story in this NCAA tournament. And now forever, they'll be known as national champions.